And the Imperial County Board of Supervisors awarded thousands of dollars to five local businesses affected by the ongoing construction on Highway 98 in Calexico. Reporter Karina Bizarte spoke to one supervisor and shares with us where the money went. These are some of the businesses being granted money after struggling for almost two years due to an ongoing construction. One of those businesses almost shutting down last year. The District Pacific Grant Program was approved by the Board of Supervisors about three months ago. This after Caltrans was not providing any help for local businesses being affected by their construction. I believe this is the second of four phases through uh, Caltrans. Uh, it is going to make Calexico and this uh, thoroughfare a lot more effective, but again, it's the headaches of the whole process and the length of time that it's taken that has taken a, a toll on these businesses. The grant program is for $100,000, which each individual business granted up to $10,000. One of the local businesses, Tropicana, almost shut down due to the construction back in June of last year. We're actually getting it today, so I'm very excited to say that they were the last one to actually submit all their paperwork, but... They are getting their check today. The other four businesses got their checks uh, last Thursday. One of the owners of a local family-owned air conditioning business that has been operating for 23 years says the construction on Highway 98 has affected them for a little over two years. Okay. La gente no puede entrar al negocio. The people sometimes can't come to my business. They come by and see the construction and see the streets are closed. So they say, never mind, I'll come later. The Board of Supervisors say they're still deciding on what to do with the rest of the money. The mayor of Calexico says that the construction on Highway 98 will be finished by this December. Reporting from Calexico, I'm Karina Basarte.